you know, things to do differently. You know, hindsight, as you know, is always 2020. We made a lot of choices going into the season, believing Malik was going to be a significant part of our team. And, you know, those aren't just captain choices and experience, but that's X's and O's and, and whatnot. And that didn't happen. You know, we lost an all-conference uh, defensive player in Malik. We lost the voice of our team. And when we lose him and when we lost him, you know, we had a very, very different front court. You know, we had a we had three freshmen basically, you know, trying to man the, the five position. So uh, that was very, very tough to handle. It's something that we couldn't have predicted with all the injuries. Um, you know, we couldn't have predicted two COVID pauses and a young team like ours. Uh, we, we needed to be in practice every single day. I mean, you saw the results when we came out of COVID. We, we just we were too young and inexperienced um, to get through it the, the way that we wanted to. Having said that, we followed every possible COVID guideline. When we traveled to Syracuse, we were a whole team. No, no, no negative or no positive tests. And uh, we land in the test that basically confirmed our Georgia Tech game from the night before, which was different from the COVID test that you take in preparation to play somebody, the Syracuse game. That was actually the day before. We were testing dang near every day. Um, there's a positive. There's one positive on our team. Now, we're traveling together. As much as you want to distance from one another, as much as you want to follow everything that you do, you know, we're going to practice. You know, we're, we're in a bus together. You know, we're, you know, in an elevator together. It's just, you know, and it took out multiple players. Um, it took out the head coach, which some might say that was a good thing. But, you know, when I'm at home for 16 straight days and can't go to practice and, uh, you know, can't be on the floor with, a, again, one of the youngest, youngest teams in the country, that's hard to make up when you're in, you know, February, late January, February. The continuity that some of the other teams have had is just difficult. So hindsight's always 20-20. If you had told me before the year, hey, you're not going to have Malik, you know, we probably would have done some things differently. But, um is what it is, and we got to learn from it. We got to get better uh, in the course of this hopefully normal off season. Go to Shannon. 